Hi, my name is Anthony Cummins, and if you don't know, we're here today. We're gonna, we've come to Nagoya, and uh, at the minute, Yoshie is uh, lost. Nay, she's lost, and we can't find the library. We're going to where we found. We're gonna go and see the original um, Chikamatsu scrolls, the Igor and Koga ninja scrolls that Chikamatsu wrote, and we're trying to find the library that we ordered them from originally, and we're gonna go see if we can have a look at the originals. So it's, we've travelled on the Shinkansen this morning all the way here, and we're struggling yes, yeah. struggling to find oh is that it yeah oh there it is <laughs> we found it hold on just matter yes here we go so this is the what museum right okay i can never remember the name Mate, I didn't go in there. That is pretty outstanding, chaps. Uh, it's hard to explain, but as you come around the corner, you didn't quite expect that. And that's pretty good. It's a reconstruction, of course, but impressive. So, some, if you're unaware, guys, this is the map of Nagoya Castle. So it says Renpeido, which is Chikamatsu's building, is actually to the south, and this is the south here. So it would have been somewhere in here. Where we don't know, where actually. So the Eager and Koga guy would have been around here doing all that. Right, we've just been having a further look at it, guys, and it seems that this wall here may be um, the actual edge of the castle. And we're not sure, but Rinpei Do, the dojo of Chikamatsu, is probably outside where at my feet are, so it might be further this way. We don't know. So obviously, we're never going to find out where it is unless we find a detailed map. But you're looking at this sort of part of the castle here. Have you got an arrow? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I just want to say something a little bit further. It's me and Yoshi have been going around now, and um, something that really is brought home is the impressiveness of Chikamatsu. So we've been here and we're at Nagoya Castle and you've got to think that this is a massive building and it's said there are about six or seven thousand direct retainers there looking after the place. Now you've got to imagine that Chikamatsu is 16 or 17 years old and he gives a demonstration to the Lord of um, Owari Tokugawa and the Lord is so impressed that he takes him on board and he actually is taught directly from the Lord and we sort of bypassed how amazing that is is the fact that there's thousands of samurai here and this 16 year old kid gave a lecture and demonstration on ei and he gave it on warfare and he was taken on board but the lord died a few months later and in the end he left and uh, he carried on the lord's school which was ichi zenryu which was then zenryu and uh, continued to teach so what you've got to remember is out of all these people chikamatsu pulled up and was impressed the Lord and was carried on with all this warfare uh, that we've put in this book for you. But even more than that is here, right here where we stood, Kimura was um, Yono Shinobi, which means he was sort of the Shinobi in the light. He was the person hired as a Kokomono. So 
it's okay reading it, guys. We're on the historical ninjutsu research team. Uh, but right here, right in this place, Chikamatsu and Kimura would study and do this stuff. And Kimura would protect, you know, this area as a shinobi. And um, people knew he was shinobi. So it's really, really impressive and it brings it home. So I hope you enjoy that. And I think once you've now seen this video, it'll bring more light into the book. So enjoy the book. And we'll carry on from there.